fought, like you said, on some of the big cards, Manny Pacquiao cards. Dr. Rook announcer Pierre Bernier. We're introducing first in the blue corner. He weighed in at 149.3 pounds. He don't just want to the song that on the point of the wearing black clean with gold. Ça touche pas ça. 20 victoires seulement deux défaites et neuf victoires dans mes heures de combat. He brings up a factual rep consisting of 20 wins, two defeats, with nine wins coming by way of knockout from Mexico, Cesar Angola Chavez. The South and 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 the South Mikhail Zuski and Cesar Chavez. Zuski's uh, knocked out seven straight opponents. Including Xavier Tolliver, who's given rounds to guys like Anthony Mundine and Michael Oliveira recently. Chavez hasn't proven himself to be quite that durable. Despite this being only his fourth fight in Quebec, you heard the great ovation he received. So, uh, He's uh, building the fan base up this way. Well, they want the local boy to do good. They want him to grow and make money, which he can obviously do with top rank. Oh, the hard uppercut, and down goes Chavez. Chavez is trying to get up. I don't know if he'll get his nope. senses, Mark. That'll be it. As a one-punch knockout for Mikhail Zuski. say about Zuski too. We we, 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 we talked to him for about 20 minutes the other day. We got a ton of notes on him. Just forgot to save that one for next time. Uh, you can crumple this one up. And speaking of crumpling, I believe that is a broken nose for Mr. Chavez as well. We like to call that a nasty uppercut and Chavez is in some serious pain in the nose area. A nasty broken nose. <laughs> someone, I, I don't know if it's if it's uh, Zeus's trainer, but someone in his corner said, "We don't often box here, but when we do, we like to make a statement." Well, he certainly <laughs> did that. Chavez again, a guy who's been ranked in the WBC. Zuski <laughs> just. <laughs> Absolutely wiped him out. Revelation. Here we go, Corey. Uh, tell us what you see. That's just a quick step back. Bang. It's kind of like a half uppercut, half hook. Right on the nose of Chavez. And that was it. You could see immediately as he up. went to the canvas. It's actually a right hand.
has that wicked hand speed of Zuski, and he will be a nightmare if he can get down to 147 in campaign there, Mark. I've seen him three, four times come away impressed every time out. He didn't even mess up his hair. He messed up someone's, someone's face tonight. His name's Cesar Chavez. He's right. He could put his clothes on and head to the club right now if he wanted to. Well, Pierre Bernier is going to tell us how quick this thing happened. Ladies and gentlemen, the end comes at 37 seconds of the very first round for the winner. And still undefeated, Mikael Murphy. Well, as Chris Gauthier pointed out, they don't fight here that often. Well, they make a statement when they do. It was a very brief homecoming, but I think one that people will remember. If you like knockouts, you're going to like this replay coming up. See, Chava is going to reach. This teaches it not to reach. <laughs> Overextended, didn't get his hands back. And Zuski filled that in with a vicious uppercut. Chavez said he likes fights that go the distance because they make you work harder. He didn't work hard, but he certainly paid the price here tonight. There's a jubilant Mikhail Zuski. Happy homecoming, Mikhail.